Natasha Doherty has come from Ireland to thank Benedict XVI for his letter to Irish Catholics on sexual abuse cases. For this reason, during the general audience, she surprised him with some unique gifts. Two of the gifts that we give the Pope were a harp and a boron, which is a tradition, they're both traditional Irish symbols. And basically the idea was musical instruments are really able to echo sound and, well, music. And the idea was for us to be able to give a symbol that will be able to um, echo the Pope's message, basically, of what he's trying to say to us back at home in Ireland and also to the rest of the world. Because at the minute in Ireland, the church is suffering a lot. Natasha also asked the Pope to bless 500 rosaries. When she returns to Ireland, she plans to give them to friends and hopes to move them. So they will pray for the Pope and his intentions, a strong way to show her support of the Catholic Church of Ireland. So I think it was nice to show him that, you know, 500 rosaries is a lot. So if 500 people are saying the rosary, there's going to be a lot, a lot of things, like a lot of graces given, you know. So basically that was our way of... Mm, supporting him and the church. So. Natasha is one of 4,000 participants in the UNIF Congress, which has united youths from all over the world in Rome.